drager van het groot lint in de ereorde van de palm. Dat is de onderscheiding die Braziliaanse ambassadeur Laudemar Aguiar op vrijdag 5 februari 2021 van president Chandrika Prasad Santoki heeft ontvangen. De diplomaat is gekomen aan het einde van zijn diensttermijn in Suriname. Hij werd middels dit eerbewijs bedankt voor zijn inzet in de afgelopen jaren voor wat betreft de relatie tussen Suriname en Brazilië. Good morning, everyone. Welcome. First Lady, Melissa Santoki Sintri, the Minister of Foreign Affairs, International Business and International Cooperation, Salva Ramdin, Chairman of the Foreign Affairs Committee of the National Assembly, Dean and members of the Diplomatic Corps, Dear Ambassador, Laudemar Gonzalves de Aguiar Neto, Permanent Secretaries, Chairman of the Advisory Committee for Tsunamis Awards, ladies and gentlemen. Allow me to welcome you at the Presidential Palace on this special occasion to reflect on the tenure of the Ambassador Extraordinary and Plenipotentiary of the Federative Republic of Brazil to the Republic of Suriname, which began on November 27, 2017. Today we are gathered here to honor and salute an excellent ambassador of an important neighboring country. We are here to bid farewell to a dear friend of all of us and of the people of Suriname. Dear Ambassador, you became a dear friend who embraced all levels of Sunamese cultural diversity, often skillfully blending Suriname and Brazil together. I congratulate you and express sincere appreciation for your energetic and charismatic efforts to lift the bilateral relations to a higher and professional level aimed at the fulfillment of the interests of both Brazil and Suriname. We look forward to receiving your president, His Excellency Jair Bolsonaro, in Suriname to engage with him in a wide range of matters that concerns both countries. It is my personal belief, Mr. Ambassador, that you have great, greatly contributed to strengthening the existing bilateral relationship between our two nations in a number of areas. You have an ex extensive record of achievements, and it would take us too far to make reference to all that you have accomplished, but allow me to name a few. The successful technical cooperation that has been intensified in the past three years is one of them. Suriname is the only country at present in the world with the largest number of projects within the ABC Cooperation Framework. Also, the valuable assistance with various high-level meetings, presidential and ministerial, many of which with the outcome of arrangements signed in the areas of foreign affairs, agriculture, defense, health, natural resources, investment, national security, institutional strengthening of the, central, of the central bank and education. But also the support in the realization of donations in the medical field for various diseases such as HIV AIDS and the Leishmaniasis during the COVID-19 COVID pandemic. And finally, Ambassador, your support to the Ministry of uh, Defense for the establishment of a military uh, academy. Mr. Ambassador, your love for Suriname was clearly noticeable. I'm informed of all of your efforts to understand and speak Dutch. Not an easy fit at all. And the fact that you can sing along when our national anthem is played is commendable and appreciated. It was also brought to my attention your support 
to the local culture and arts and the impressive array of paintings and sculptures purchased by you during your stay in Suriname. You will enjoy it when you'll be back home. <laughs> It would be a remiss of me uh, to not refer to your special personal project of adopting the Open Bar School, Company Creek, and Brocopondo, and making necessary re renovations to the school for the benefit of the school children. Ambassador Laudemar, hartelijk dank for your insight tijdens uw ambtsperiode. De relatie tussen Brazilië en Suriname heeft tijdens uw verblijf in Suriname zeker grote hoogte bereikt. Nogmaals dank en succes in uw verdere carrière. In closing, ambassador, I extend to you our sincerest gratitude for your friendship and valuable contributions. Muito obrigado, ambassador. It is with great pleasure that I hereby, on behalf of the government and people of the Republic of Suriname, appoint you as bearer of the Grand Ribbon in the honorary order of the Palm. Ambassador Parabins. Ambassador Lodemar you have the opportunity to express your gratitude. Your Excellency, Shandika Persad, uh, Santoki, President of the Republic of Suriname, and the First Lady, Minister of Foreign Affairs, International Business and International Cooperation, Minister Albert Ramdin, PS Miriam McIntosh and Lucien Treidman, uh, the representatives of the of the National Assembly and the Order. My dear friends and colleagues from the Diplomatic Corps, my guardian angel from MBBs now, Ambassador Audrey Christopher, all protocols observed. I usually I am more at ease and uh, I can express maybe myself uh, in a more freely way, but I am really overwhelmed. I never expected this to happen. I feel blessed, some would say by God, some by the universe. I would say I am blessed for having been ambassador to Suriname. I, would, uh, I will take this decoration not only for me, for what I did, which I didn't do alone, but all the staff of the embassy, the Minister of Foreign Affairs of Brazil, with the Minister of, of, of uh, Foreign Affairs of Suriname, and all of our partners, and the whole of the society of uh, Suriname. What was achieved, which was far less than what I wanted, what I should have done or could have done, was achieved because we acted as a team, we acted as real partners that respect each other and that have real friendship for each other. I have said it, and I'll say it again, Suriname was a wonderful surprise for my career and in my private life. As you all know, I'm taking some dogs from Suriname as well with me to Teheran. I've uh, always felt welcome. I've always felt cooperation friendship from all of Surinamese people and people who live in Suriname. As I had the opportunity to say, you make us feel connected. You make us feel loved, 
and welcome whenever we go. I'll just uh, say 30 more, um, I have 30 more seconds. Uh, I'd like to mention uh, Your Excellency, how I appreciate your simplicity, your commitment, even before you became the President of the Republic of Suriname. I remember very well that you didn't miss any of our Independence Days. You were there, always. And as you were still leader of the position, how you reached for us and how we met at the Embassy and you put forward your plans for the future of Suriname. I also remember Minister Albert Ramdin, who before becoming minister, also he reached for diplomats and was the first person that invited the diplomatic corps to visit a private enterprise in the interior of Suriname. That means that uh, you're not uh, tweeting me like this only in your present postings, in your present positions. You have always done that, wherever you were. I want to thank also the PS of uh, former Buza, MBBs, Miriam and Luciana for always being there for me and all of your teams. And again, my guardian angel, Audrey Christopher, from day one, showing me how to proceed to have the meeting, uh, uh, to have my credentials. Uh, the DNA, the National Assembly, and everyone again, and my friends and colleagues, the ones who have left, the ones who are here, you have been true friends, we have always been together. And of course, to all of my staff at the Embassy, represented here by my deputy now, Gustavo Pereira. I will leave Suriname, but I'll take Suriname in my heart and in my mind. Uh, I'm not going to ask for anything else, Mr. President. You have already given me too much. But if, whenever I retire, if I decided to spend my life between Brazil and Suriname, I hope that I'll be able to have a permanent visa to come here. Thank you so much. Thank you all. Grantani. Mr. Ambassador, today you have been decorated by the President of the Republic of Suriname. I'm more than convinced that you deserve it. How are you feeling? Uh, as I told uh, Mr. President uh, and people who are here, I'm overwhelmed. Uh, I never expected it, uh, but uh, I feel uh, I am blessed, as I, t I said, uh, for being ambassador here for more than three years and for having this uh, last uh, expression of friendship between Brazil and Suriname, because I know it's not only me, it's a teamwork, and it uh, represents the friendship between our two peoples and our two countries. Can you address some specific issues that you have been able to realize as ambassador in Suriname? Uh, again, as I told you, uh, uh, it was a teamwork. I don't say I did it, but uh, uh, the embassy did it, 
with our ministry, with all the other ministries in uh, Suriname, with the private sector, with the uh, civil society. But I think uh, uh, two things uh, come to my mind. First, uh, the technical cooperation that uh, we managed to develop uh, in several different areas, from agriculture to health to, uh, 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 I mean, to, to institution, uh, institutions, between institutions, and, uh, and uh, education and uh, the, the environment. Uh, I think uh, we got, we, we continue the, the, the work. The, something that I'd like to say, it's not something that we didn't have before, and uh, it started with me. I mean, it's a building up uh, a cooperation that we've had in the last years since your independence that my predecessors uh, did, and I built upon what they did, and my successor, who will come in March, will do. Uh, but also in the, in the spread of uh, uh, culture and education between us, uh, you have a wonderful expression of culture. I see here this fantastic uh, uh, picture painting from Sukiro di Cromo, who unfortunately passed away uh, uh, last year. And uh, uh, I really uh, think that if we uh, come closer together in culture and education, I mean, our countries will know each other much better. And uh, the third that uh, I forgot to mention uh, in, my, in, my, in my words, that I feel very grateful that the Brazilian community in Suriname is now considered, even by the president, by the government, as part of uh, uh, the society of Suriname. This, I think, to get closer to the Brazilian community and uh, uh, to be able to do things uh, uh, with the Brazilian community in Suriname, I think it's something that uh, 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 I'll take with me as well. Thank you, Ambassador. You are, going no, you are now going to work in Iran as Ambassador. I wish you success and good luck. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you all. Grand <laughs>